Welcome back to AZAM. Love a good big breakfast. Yeah, sticks with you all day mm -hmm. then. Matt's big breakfast. Yeah, when big breakfast is in the name of the place, you know it's good. Yeah. How big, Corey? I know, isn't it fantastic? Now, Matt's, uh, what we're standing in front of now is Matt's old location at First and McKinley. Now, it was an ironically named place, of course. Would you say Matt's big breakfast? Hey, buddy. Uh, because it's about 34 square feet here. Hey, buddy. Uh, but now they've moved up the street. And if, if we can wait for us, uh, swing around this way, if you would, Tom, just give people an idea of where we are here. Look at the beautiful Westward Ho. Now, that is an iconic Phoenix shot. And um, we're just up the street, you know, a little bit uh, east of Central, just one block uh, right on First Street. But if you've never been to Matt's, you might as well get on down here. Super popular, of course, and Matt's been at it a long time. Uh, the place is continually, hey, hey buddy, continually uh, wins, you know, best breakfast in town, that sort of thing. Uh, new times, best of, this and that. And uh, their philosophy is keep your sunny side up. So they moved one block, and since we've got the time and it's such a pretty day, we thought we'd take a stroll on down, show you what's happening. Love this part of town, too, because everything's on the way up. This is the time to buy, people, because uh, property values are skyrocketing here. Now, when we get inside, we're going to meet up with er uh, Ma Ernie, the manager. Yeah, there you go. The murals on this building, by the way, are fantastic on both sides. Hey, buddy. Thanks for, thanks for watching. You're watching the right station, brother. Thank you. We've got a lot of Fox 10 friends around here. But, by the way, 6.30 is when we open, and we close at 2.30. Hey, you guys. That's the way to run a restaurant, in my opinion. Closed at 2.30, then you're home in time for dinner yourself. But it's noisy in Matt's, that's for sure. And it's because the place is always jammed. There you go. I like to stand right in the traffic route. Here's Ernie herself. She's whizzing by. We'll catch her in a second because we're going to show off some of the grub here. But uh, they're glad to have a little more square footage here than they used to. And I love the whole scene in here, the, uh, the noise. Look at that. That's why they call it Matt's Big Breakfast, because everything is big. By the way, let's see what we're looking at. What do you have here, friend? What are the two dishes? This is a salami scramble with sobasada salami. Yeah. And this is our hog and chick with our peppered bacon. Nice. Well done, friend. I like that, the hog and chick. Oh boy, it sounds like my uncle. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, and I love a restaurant that does everything in chalk. Place has a lot of style. So let's swing on back toward the front. We're going to find out what is for breakfast over here. We're going to meet up with, er oh, Ernie, you have outdone yourself. This is fantastic. Yeah, thanks. We're glad to be at Matt's. Now, you, I love the inventive nature of your menu. I mean, anybody could just throw out a bunch of eggs and bacon. This is really, really clever. What are we looking at there? So these are local organic baby greens mm -hmm. with uh, organic arugula. And we scrambled three egg whites with local organic baby spinach, our chicken sausage, and chicken apple sausage, and gruyere. And it's for the gluten-free, you know, healthy, yeah. conscious. You put Gruyere cheese in there? Yes. All the fancy not? cheese? Of course. That's yeah, why not, about. indeed? And uh, the pancakes, et cetera. Beautiful. Yeah. What are we at? This is our special. This morning, it's the huevos rancheros. And it's served with the hash browns. And we have organic oh, I'm sorry. Those are tortillas under there. Yeah. I <laughs> gotcha. So, yeah, this is... Uh, we always have a daily special, and on Mondays it's always Wibbles Run Chairs, which is our local favorite. Yeah. And uh, yeah, that's what Matt's Big Breakfast is all about. Yeah, speaking of favorites, I know you have a lot of regular I fans here. You probably see a lot of the same faces. Absolutely. For you got any real troublemakers in here, by the way? Right here. Oh, really? Right. Uh, see, now, I didn't want to point him out to everyone, but he has that look about him. Uh, wh what do you like about this place? You could eat breakfast anywhere. What's your, what's your, what do you like about it? I like the fact that it's a local restaurant, mm -hmm. and I wanted to find a place that uh, had a good breakfast. Yeah. So that's why I came. Very good. Well, you made the right choice, apparently. Much of the valley agrees. You continue uh, winning prizes. Well, thanks, friend. And chicken sausage, is that what? Uh... Oh, chicken and apple?
It's all yours. How am I supposed to continue the show after eating that? I don't know. That's why I'm, that's why I'm here. Yeah. <laughs> well, Ernie, thanks for hosting us this morning. Again, we're at First Street in Garfield on the uh, southeast corner. Easy to find. It's the only building in the neighborhood that has Matt's Big Breakfast written on the side. Well, no, it's one of two, actually. Right. We just saw your old location. Well, congrats on the big move to the new digs. And uh, come see us any morning, uh, Troy and Andrea, from 630 to 230. Come with a thousand of your friends, and uh, there's going to be room for you. Sometimes there's a line, but it's always worth the wait. So, Corey, it's 10 a.m. on a Monday, and that place is yeah. packed. I want their life. I know. These are not people that they scared up for us. No. This is the actual way the place works. And when your reputation precedes you, you're going to be full at this oh, hour of the day. Wow. And it oh, looks like we got some spring breakers here. Perhaps uh, some Cactus League fans here in the orange hats. Uh, yeah, this is not your uh, typical valley there. look here. They're doing something right. I'm not sure what state they're from. There's I'm guessing place, Minnesota. Yeah. Some orange hat state, that for looks sure. like Marty Manning. Yeah. Isn't it? Yeah. It's not, but it looks like Come him. see us at Matt's, everybody. Thanks, Bye. Corey. And thank you, seriously, so much for tuning in. You let us do the job we love. We'll see you tomorrow.